we got all of our chores done. All the kids are picked up. Homework is done. Now I am looking for dinner. Right here, we're gonna make beef stroganoff. So you need, I just use a pound of burger, but this one says one boneless beef sirloin, pound. Medium onion, I just use dried onions because I don't care for onions. Um, a can of cream of mushroom soup, a half a teaspoon of paprika, and a third of a cup of sour cream. And four cups of egg, egg noodles. I usually like to just use one of the bags and then I'll just double the recipe of the soup, the paprika, and the sour cream. So, let's get started. And while my water is boiling, um, I have a dish to wash to help make dinner. I am going to make my um, bread so we can have it tomorrow for dinner. And I just make it in this big bowl. It's a 2.5 quart. Um, and I just leave it sitting on my counter or on my stove top. But you need flour, salt, yeast, and water. We're going to add three cups of flour. And this makes like a sourdough bread because you leave it overnight and kind of let it get sour. But it's perfect for um, grilled cheese, just toasted bread. I haven't really ate it as a sandwich. Um, but it is super easy. You don't have to knead it. And it's just really quick to make. Next you need two, you have three cups of flour, two teaspoons of dry yeast, and you need a teaspoon and a half of salt. I have to grind mine up. Then when you're getting your water, I can't remember who it is um, that I watch on Instagram. It's either the Food Nanny or the Turner Farm. They make a lot of sourdough um, bread and they say that because yeast is alive essentially um, and you don't want to kill it so you don't want your water too hot and you don't want your water too cold. So they say to heat it like you would for a baby's bath on your wrist and then it's the perfect temperature. First I'm going to whisk my bowl of dry ingredients together. And when I use this pink Himalayan salt, it um you when you cut the bread you'll have like tints of pink in it. It's kind of funny. And then they call for a cup and a half. But I always end up having to add more to it. And you want it to be like um, really sticky. I'm learning all these new bread terms. Because before I was like sticky. Why would you want your bread to be sticky? Well, you do for sourdough. So sometimes I usually have to add like maybe a fourth of a cup. I just put a little bit in. See, it's not super... It's not super sticky, it's still pretty dry. It's still really dry, so I'm gonna get a little bit more water. And pour just a little bit in there. And see how that goes. So now it looks pretty sticky-like. It's like wet, it's all mixed together. Um, now I'm just going to get a plastic wrap. I have my beef on the stove and my water boiling and now I don't know if other <clears throat> working moms or even stay at home moms are like this but I don't like to do dishes after dinner so during this time while my meat is cooking and my water is boiling I am going to get my dishes done um, I already did some of them that were in the sink because I needed to cook with them, but I 
have a few other ones that, oh, my whole dishwasher needs to be emptied, so I'm going to work on that right now. I got my noodles in. I didn't realize these take so long. I got this huge bag. Um, they're homemade style. Sorry. Um, egg pasta from Sam's Club. Not sure. Oh, not members mark brand. But yeah, I got this big bag at Sam's Club. Um, and then I'm going to add my um, minced onions to this. Too. And I just buy those also from. Can I buy them from? Oh, I have some from Walmart, these kind. They make it flavor. Just like. It just crashed. It's been out all night. Yeah. to add my soup and my cream cheese sour cream not cream cheese dork and then um, I'm also gonna fix a salad with dinner because the boys have said that would be great for a veggie so I'm gonna do that also did he? Yeah. that happened so I just add these two in there I have the heat turned on low and then I just mix it up. And then I add my sour cream. Will we go out and get some broccoli, please? For mom? Broccoli, please? Okay, let's see what I need. I need... A third of a cup of sour cream. You know, I'm not even going to measure. One. Two. One more for good measure. This looks so delicious. So, like, what I like to do for myself is so I'm not getting all the noodle carbs. Is I will make myself. I just needed one bag out of there. Oh, perfect. Some broccoli. I get these from Sam's. For some reason, they take longer to cook. In my microwave than any other ones do. Put them in for seven and a half minutes. And you let it go. And then I have to add paprika to that still too. I'm not sure why you add it in I just do I've never tried it without it. sometimes I measure things other times I don't this I just kind of sprinkle it all over the top this is a fresh thing and don't want to come out it says a half a half a teaspoon so I just like to cover it just like that and then you mix it all together and then this is done so then I'll take this and just mix the noodles in, but I like to pull some out to put over top of my broccoli, is what I like to do. Mmm. So good. And this was doubling the recipe. So I used two cans instead of one, and I used two thirds of cream cheese and just a bunch of paprika. And one pound of burger. I leave the meat the same, and the noodle amount the same. And these look delicious. And my salad is literally a bowl of lettuce. And we set out bacon bits, cheese, all different kinds of dressings, and sunflower seeds, and the kids make their own. Um, we do a lot of make your own stuff here at our house. I find that, honestly, that the kids eat better if they get to make their own 
salads, their own plates, and everything like that. And I, they also like Caesar salads, so that's why I don't always like to mix our salads up ahead of time because they will make themselves a Caesar salad. Yep. Now, I'm just gonna wait for the noodles to finish cooking and then everything will be ready for dinner. Boys are washed up besides this one is tired. Oh, he took a late nap. We'll get in bed. I'll come give kisses when you're done reading. Holler for me. Boys are going in to read themselves a story. And I forgot to show you what dinner looked like when it was all done. There it is. All mixed together. The lettuce was almost gone. I'm the only one that ate the broccoli, but oh well. And the kitchen is yet a disaster again. So much for cleaning. What, Willard? My blanket and a washer, and I need a... I need to have one. Oh, why don't you go get the dinosaur one? Well, why didn't you switch the laundry then? I did. You did? I don't think so. What dinosaur I'm going to put all the footage on my tablet. I'm going to get to editing and call it a night.